Hey kids, welcome to the show. Today we're going to talk about some of the comments I've been receiving. All good stuff, all positive stuff, some good ideas. And we're also going to do a couple quick reviews and as always, some quick giveaways. So stick around for the free booty and, you know, listen to whatever I got to say. Whatever that's worth. All right, so I thought we'd open the show with a quick review. Uh, so we're going to do a Marvel Legends figure. I stopped collecting Marvel Legends because it just got too much for me. At the time, I wasn't really making enough money to support five different collecting styles, so I decided to focus on one. But I do still look at the figures. I love looking at them. They're, they're still awesome. They're still great. If I was a kid, I'd be playing with them all the time. So what we're going to do today is Sam Wilson, the Falcon figure. So I'll read you what's on the back really quick. Sam Wilson soars through the skies, dispensing justice and restoring faith in humanity. So this is the Sam Wilson. I don't know if you guys have watched the animated Avengers uh, shows like uh, Avengers Assemble. They're both on Disney+. Plus. I'm watching them right now, actually. And this seems to be that Sam Wilson. He has the red holograph-looking wings, and they attach to the back of his arms like that so I believe he shoots the plushettes I hope I'm saying that right uh, it's a great figure the look on his face is amazing so I'm gonna get a close-up on that I, th I think that looks so real it's so badass but anyway as far as the figure goes a plus it's a great looking figure so, if you want this figure, tell me why in the comments. It'll be yours, maybe. Unless you've already won. That brings me to the next part of the video. I got some suggestions. Uh, the best ones I got were from Bulldrek. He tells me, stop giving away so much. Problem is, is I have a huge backlog of stuff to give away. So, I'm going to try and give it all away real quick. Catch up. And then I'll scope it scale it down a little scope it i'm so stupid um <clears throat> other one was set some rules for giveaways which i'm doing right now you can only one win win one time a month sorry but i think that's fair right um i can't ship across the the pond can't can't ship over to europe not right now maybe we'll get there but not just yet um as far as doing more involved reviews, I will do them as involved as I possibly can. Problem is, is I don't always see a whole lot to review. I mean, you guys are gonna buy the stuff if you don't get it for free, right? So these are good characters, good figures. Anyway, that brings us to our next quick review. So this one, I've got uh, two, of, two more of the carbonized vintage collection figures from Star Wars. First one I'm going to do is the Stormtrooper, the Remnant Stormtrooper. And like I said with the other one, the packaging is absolutely beautiful. I don't know what to do with a carbonized Stormtrooper. I'm sorry about the lighting. Uh, but the best thing I can say, this that it, the color of his armor reminds me of the white jelly beans at Easter time that nobody eats. I mean, it's cool. It's going up on the wall or one of these walls here. It'll look great up there, but I, I, I can't see what I would do with this out of the package. Now that brings us to the next one, the Mandalorian. This figure, out of all the carbonized figures, looks the best. And it's not just because he's the Mando, but I believe the carbonizing actually serves the character. So here's your regular vintage collection Mando. Great colors, nice earth tones. Very muted though, right? So, that brings us to the carbonized one. And you see how the armor looks there? I think the armor looks amazing. The leather looks more real. His helmet looks more real. So this one I would actually use out of the package if I were to kind of got to just open every single thing I got, which I kind of do, but whatever. Um, so this one gets the super thumbs up. The Stormtrooper gets the thumbs up It'll look good on the wall but I wouldn't put it into a diorama there's really no need for it 
also they have carbonized the dirt. <laughs> the dirt is carbonized on the remnant storm trooper. I don't know why this one is so difficult to see, but the dirt is also carbonized. So great attention to detail there, Hasbro. So, other than that, I hope I kept it down to a quick watch time. I looked at my analytics, and they say that people only watch for about two minutes. So, if you guys could watch a little bit longer, I'd appreciate it. Give it the like, the thumbs up, I'd appreciate that. If you subscribe, I'd appreciate that. Share, leave a comment if you want a toy, all that stuff. I know you guys have to do this for everybody else's videos, so I, I won't bother you too much more about it. Other than that, keep the feedback coming in. You know, I grow with you guys. You guys grow with me. You give me advice, I'll clean up my act a little, and, you know, two years from now, we'll all be sitting somewhere in the sun, hopefully enjoying our toys. All right. Have a good night. Have a good day tomorrow.